Hello, hello. Hi, everyone out there. Cyber World Holistic Gals is here. Hello, all you all. Google Plus, on my Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. How you guys doing? Hope is here today to show you how to prevent dry skin. I, now, I know winter is over, but guess what? We still get ashy year round. That's not just a winter thing. And if you're like me, your legs get really ashy, especially after I shave them. Yeah, really dry. Um, first things first, we need to make sure that we're drinking enough water. I'm going to give you a, an example of it. If you are 100 pounds, divide your weight in half. That would be 50 pounds, which means you should be drinking 50 ounces of water a day. We have to hydrate our body so that we can flush out toxins. And remember, our body is made up majority of water, so we need water. So first things first, make sure that you're drinking enough water. Next thing, one of my favorite, favorite soaps to use is the Dudu Osun soap. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Dudu, yeah, but it doesn't smell like Dudu. Anyway, <laughs> it smells really good. It's like a tropical, has a tropical-like smell. Um, I love this. It's black soap. You may see black soap um, made differently, but this is one I love and I stand by. I'm um, just going to read the ingredients off to you. It has pure honey, shea butter, osun, which is cam wood, palm kernel oil, cocoa pod ash, palm bunch ash, aloe vera, lime juice, water. So this is a very good soap or whatever. So I use this black soap. And of course, you know I have to have my shea butter. I use my shea butter, guys. You can get this from local beauty supply. Also with the black soap, also you can get that from um, I think most international stores or your local beauty supply. What I do with this shea butter is, it smells good. It's like this. I've broken up some. Sometimes I'll set it in the sink in a sink of warm water and I'll let it melt down some so I'll take some and put it on my hand like this in the middle and rub it together rub it together really good and my hands I work in the school system with children so I'm constantly washing my hands because they have snotty noses 90% of the time. So I use this. I love shea butter. I love the smell. Smell of it. Smells warm. Smells like cocoa butter a little bit. But I put that on my hands. And but I need to seal it. So I seal it with this. This is organics, ultimate organics moisturizing body gloss. And this works really good, guys. I'm going to tell you some of the ingredients that's in here. This oil has aloe, vitamin E, coconut, almond oil, sesame oil, olive oil, clove oil, mink, and eucalyptus oils, and ginseng extract. And it works really good. So, I got also local beauty supply, guys. This... They have everything. So I'll put a little bit of oil on my hand after I put on my shea butter. And then I just rub it in. Rub it in all over my body. This smells so good. This smells tropical. So it kind of seals the deal with the um, black African soap. And I just rub it all over. And it works, guys. I am not dry by 10 a.m., which I was beforehand just using the shea butter alone just wasn't enough so I needed something to seal it in and this oil really does the job so you know you ladies you're getting ready for the summertime you're gonna be wearing those short shorts and those cute little sundresses so you want to make sure that your legs and feet are not ashy because that's not cute put a little bit on my feet up here y'all can't see but they're nice and polished like my hands. So, Anyway, guys, that's what Holistic Gals uses on her skin. I use African black soap. I use shea butter. And I use 
Ultimate Organics Body Oil. So if you have any more questions, like, comment, subscribe below. Let me know what are your favorite products. How do you stay um, um, from getting nasty? How do you keep your skin moisturized? That's my, my routine. Let me know what you guys use. Have a great day. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.